you know what's really annoying okay so i'm kind of i'm trying to sell this camera that i currently have right because i want to upgrade and get a sony a7 IV, which is an amazing camera right but i can't just buy it because i don't have that much money so i'm trying to sell the, this current camera so i can afford to buy the a7 IV. but there's a problem i'm not trying to get scammed you know you know I, i'm super nervous to sell it on like ebay or something like that because i don't want them to be like oh he never got it and then doesn't let me pull the money out or something like that like oh i would fucking cry mm. so i'm trying to sell it on like craigslist so i can at least meet up with them in person and you know avoid getting scammed i mean the only risk with like doing a craigslist transaction is like getting fucking robbed <laughs> but like <laughs> But, I don't know, I just feel like that's less likely than getting scammed online, you know? I'm just trying to not get scammed by a fucking 12 year old, you know? I don't know, let me know if you guys have any experience with like selling stuff on eBay or whatever. You know, I feel like it's a, it's a different story if I'm trying to sell something that's like 50 bucks. Cause like if that doesn't work out, like yeah that sucks, but it's like it's 50 bucks, you know? If I can't sell, if I get fucked over on this camera, I will, I will probably I will probably drink an entire bottle of vodka if that happens so but anyways welcome back to the channel today we're going to be watching stranger things season four episode two we're on the second episode we got introduced to a couple new characters last episode eddie and chrissy well chrissy's dead now she died in the very last she died in the end of the last episode r.i.p to her but eddie saw what fucking happened to her you know it was it was going on in her head right like, she was being attacked by the, this new monster. I don't think we got a name for it yet. But she was being attacked in her head. But then Eddie, when Eddie was looking at her, she was, just, yeah, she was just like this, like paralyzed. You know, she couldn't move. And then her, like, body started levitating and then thrown against the ceiling and shit. Yeah. So that's, that's great. That's great. We also found out Hop is alive. Joyce got the letter in the mail from the Russians that Hop is alive. Now, in the season in the post credit scene of season three episode eight they did okay when they were like going to experiment with the fully grown demodog they were like the american you know and the guy's like no don't get the american right now okay I, evan on patreon told me that that they were talking about jim right there now like i literally saw jim get fucking disintegrated bro i like i had no reason to believe they could have been talking about him right there okay but I guess he's alive, so, and it was also, it was also known before the season even premiered, so for you guys, when you first saw it, you were probably expecting him to be alive anyway, so, yeah. But anyways, I'm gonna stop wasting time, we're just gonna hop right into this episode. If you'd like to watch the full length reaction, that'll be available on Patreon, as well as early access to the next two episodes of Stranger Things Season 4 will also be available on Patreon, so, let's get started. Oh, here's Jim. Okay, so if he's not dead, how did this fucker survive? Oh, okay, he ran away, okay. Oh, okay, okay. He jumped down, alright. What, he jumped through the gate as... No. Mmm. I guess it didn't, like, actually show his body be, like, literally disintegrated. It was just heavily implied. You know, because, like, the other four people that were closer to Joy... You know what I mean? They just, they absolutely got disintegrated, so... I guess... Whatever, I'm happy he's back, so... Whatever. Also, I am recording this at a very reasonable time tonight. I am not recording at fucking 1am. I'm recording this at 9.30 and not 1am, so... How much do you guys want to bet that I'm going to get interrupted at least twice? The over-under is two and a half. You think over two times or under two times? I'm saying over. <laughs> also, a detail that I missed in the last episode, but I, I caught when I was editing, was Max was actually listening to the game that was going on. So she, she still fucks with Lucas a little bit, you know? She wasn't there, but she was listening to it. She, so she knows what happened. Nah, this fucking guy again. This cop's cool, but the other guy... That guy's such a fucking doofus. Mother of God. Oh, how bad is it? <gasps> uh, oh, oh, her body's all 
fucking tangled up. Oh, yeah. That's right, because if the demon broke all our fucking limbs. So Max has an idea of, like, okay, it, it's possibly back. She better go fucking tell her. I mean, like, as an audience, we know it's back. But to her, it's like, oh, shit. To her, it's like, oh, shit, is it back? She better go fucking tell everyone now. Describe it. I've never seen hmm. anything like it. What the hell I'm looking at, or... Okay. Careful, careful, careful. You're squishing, you're squishing your present. Bro, what is Michael wearing, bro? Is that what he thinks people from California wear? He thinks they dress up like that? It's just this painting I've been working on. Cool. That's a rad Okay. That was awkward. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no, it's a shitty knockoff. <laughs> Sweat it, man. I'll get you the good threads out of here. I heard a lot about your sister. <coughs> Should we go? Yeah, this is kind of awkward, man. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of, kind of is. Then after burritos, I want to go to Rinko. Um, Will feels so, so left out like a fucking third wheel here. Friends. You know, Stacy and Angela. Angela. You okay. that. Oh wait, Stacy and Angela, bro, bitch, those are not your fucking friends. But she, she wants to. Oh, there's Marie. She wants to flex on Stacy and Angela. Especially Angela, that she has a boyfriend. I have said everything I need to say. Mm -hmm. Nervous, and the words they just they keep spilling out. Yeah. My my brain is moving faster than my mouth, or or rather my my mouth yep. is moving faster than my brain. It feel like that. We can confirm that the body of a Hawkins High student was discovered early this morning. Yep. Benny's burgers. Oh, that was the fool that got waxed in season one that found L. Oh no, does Lucas have a hangover? Oh, uh, yep, he does. Oh, great news, guys. My camera fucking sold on eBay. Wow. Hey, maybe Chrissy didn't stand you up after all. Hey, don't say that. Relax. Yeah, really insensitive, dude. He doesn't think it's Chrissy. But it was. Oh no, now they're coming after him to ask him some questions. Like, you or her boyfriend, what? Did you murder her? Like, what do you know? <laughs> Ago, uh, one thing after another. Yeah. That this town is cursed. Oh yeah, it is. Uh, yep, yeah, it's easy in flashbacks of Barb. The last time she ever saw Barb. Would you be up for a field trip? Yes. Let's ride. I can't anymore. I just can't take it. So everyone in Hawk who is still here in Hawkins is aware. Yep, Max is here. I'm talk to Dustin about it. Better anything, but I guarantee you, Eddie is suspect number one right now. That's yeah. crazy. Eddie didn't do this. No way. Yeah, he didn't. But like, no but like the way he's gonna tell him what, say what happened, or it's gonna sound like he's fucking insane. I mean, no one was nice to us. Yep. No one except Eddie. Well, I mean, they said the same shit about Ted Bundy. <laughs> We're nice guy, but then he's murdering women on the weekend. Uh, that's pretty valid, yeah. Like you never know what they're truly up to. After I saw Eddie and Chrissy go in the trailer. Mm-hmm. Something else happened. Yeah. Uh. Oh, I'd have a f if I was Max. Be oh, she can even hear Eddie screaming. But being Max, being what she's been through with them in the past, bro, I'd have a fucking panic attack if all the lights just did that. Cause you know what that means. Nothing that weird or anything. Damn, Eddie just fucking dipped. The power goes off in my place all the time. It's a piece of shit. Oh. The look on his face. Mm-hmm. He was he was terrified. You know, he he just killed someone or saw something. Something else killed her. Yep. Max doesn't even want to fucking say it and put it out there because it's like, you're just like no way it's back. Like no way. There's only one person who knows what actually happened. And that's Eddie. Eddie. All right, let's go find him. They're gonna go find Eddie. They're gonna be like, yo, bro, what happened? He's gonna be like, you are, he's gonna be like, you aren't gonna fucking believe me. And they're gonna be like, bro, we've been through this shit three times already. We, we'll believe you, don't worry. I like it even less in person. Oops. <laughs> Hup is alive, no government? Yeah. Signed Enzo. So? so Where the fuck is Enzo? About our date at Enzo's and that's uh, me and- Hmm, okay. Sending me a message. Yeah. But Murray's just being the skeptical one he is. You saw him die, Joyce. Yeah. I thought I thought he fucking died. I didn't see a body. Yeah, I I thought there was no body because it He evaporated. It, yes, exactly. An elaborate ruse to capture you as well. 
I'm already just making too much sense. You just made all that up. No. Well, I prefer mine. Ah. So do I. Yeah, we all, me too. Hey, this could be real. <laughs> Hopper could be alive. And so we have to at least try. Suppose there's only one way to find out. What are you doing? We're gonna call that number. Yep. The hell sent you that letter. Fuck it. My way. Okay, but yeah, Murray's fucking, he has all the shit we need. He has a VPN, he had Star 67, you know. He's got it. Yep, and the Russians found him alive and they captured him. This woman, who is she? Yep, they want to get her. Get the elephant, what the fuck? Ah. Thought they were about to hotbox him for... <laughs> Damn, that'd be a ho oh shit. Damn. That'd be a horrible way to die, dude. Ah. Uh, dude, just like not being able to breathe or drowning. Ah. Uh, worst way, worst fear for me. That's that would be the worst way for me to die. Oh my god. That looks like the the pizza van from fucking Toy Story. Yeah, bitch. Do you come here a lot? Yeah. No. <laughs> I go to parties here. It's a big party place. Oh my god, why is she trying to impress him so much? Did you forget about the songs? I mean, since you come here all the time. Yeah. Why do you keep lying? Mm -hmm. You're friends with Angela and Stacy, and you come to parties here? Mm hmm. Damn, now she feels bad. <sighs> Dude, I'm so trash at roller, at roller skating. Holy shit. Like, Mike looks pretty bad right here, but I guarantee you I'm worse. And Will's alone again. <sighs> I feel bad, dude. Aw, oh, this bitch is here. Ah. Uh... Who's that twig with her? Ah. Uh... Mitch has a boyfriend. Yep, then Angela is gonna go up to Elle and Mike, and then Elle is gonna be like, Oh, Mike, this is my friend Angela. Then Angela's just gonna embarrass her. I'm good. Hmm. I see a whole lot of beer around. Mm-hmm. The fun last night? Are you gonna arrest me for drinking? Yeah, you're like fucking 16, yes. No, they can't. Oh, for trespassing myself. People have been using this shit hole for years, man. Oh, it's abandoned, I guess. I mean, she said she was gonna go home, get changed, something like that. Oh, he doesn't... Oh, uh, he doesn't know it's Chrissy. They just know it's a student. Ah. What about Eddie Munson? Mm -hmm. Never seen her talking to him? That freak? <gasps> what does Eddie have to do with all this? Dude. Okay, whoever... This kid reminds me of like a... Reminds me of fucking Tom Cruise. Did he hurt Chrissy? His like voice and cadence. The way, and like the way he talks reminds me of Tom Cruise. Hey. Oh no. Oh no, Jason knows. Jason! <laughs> For the way he walks away. <laughs> But you can't believe what he just heard. Basically, just found out Chrissy's dead. Damn, bro. That fucking scream. See this? How many phones do you have? Someone was murdered. How many phones? Yeah, someone was murdered. They don't know. Who, they don't know it's Chrissy. Doing man. Setting up base of operations here. Base. Dustin, you don't fucking work here. <laughs> Uh, do you want me to strangle him, or do you want to do that? We can take turns. Mm-hmm. Do this. Fill us in on what? Yep, it's back. You're not Jonathan. Clearly not. And you never will be. But I know you. I don't think so. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he does? Actually, I do know you. Oh, shit. You're Fred Benson. Oh, fuck. You killed that kid last year. What? Wait, what? What? What are you talking about? Ugly scar in your face. What? It's from that crash. Oh. Uh... Oh. An accident. Wait, what the fuck? That one ran all the way home instead of calling us. Wait, what the fuck? Why, why is this? The murderer. The fuck? Well, they got in, but... Sorry. Wait, let me see the other side of your face so I can see if that score is actually there or not. This letter to Lenora community. Mm. That's... But you're going to Emerson with Nancy. Nope. No. Damn. She just... Doesn't know it yet. Wait, hold on. What is going? Damn. To 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 chase a dream that isn't mine. Yeah. So I, I just so I just tell her the truth. Yes. 
No, no, because because if I told her the truth, you'll break up. But she'd just she just throw her dreams out the window to come out here and be with me. And yeah, you'll break her heart for sure. But you don't. Yeah, you don't want to take her off her life and what she's trying to do because that you're not going anymore. Oh, the cycle never ends. Yeah. Facts. What is your approach here, man? To just slow motion break up with Nancy? Yeah. Yes. No! That's horrible, dude. That's it's so painful to do that. Back, back in the back of the van. Go! Ah! Got me stressed out. It's not even my girlfriend. <laughs> That's how it is whenever you're, you're talking to your friends about their relationships and like they need advice. Like, bro, it stresses you the fuck out, dude. This is Mike, my boyfriend. Uh, uh, what about you? It's really cool to finally meet some of El Jane's friends. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, super cool. Come on, friend. No. No. Oh, hold on to that. Fuck, okay, fuck you. Oh, no, dude. Will, go stand up for her. Go fucking beat Angela's ass, bro. No. What? She hasn't been telling you. Yeah, you gotta tell Mike. She's lying to you, Mike. Bullshit. Listen yeah. to me. She's having problems here. Problems? Okay. What kind of problems? Like making friends. Stay put. No. I fuck you. I'm not staying put. This next song is dedicated to Jane. Fuck. The local snitch. Fuck. Uh, fuck off. Um. Freak. Oh, this is so fucked up. This is so fucked up. I'm I'm fucking. <laughs> and they're fucking recording it. Mike, go do yes, go beat that DJ's ass. Yes. Sorry, I can't hear you. Oh, I'm fucking. Oh my god, I'm fucking socking him right in the jaw. If he said, oh, if I was Mike, oh my god. I said, turn it off. If you say, wipe out. <laughs> I'm beating that kid's fucking ass. I don't give a fuck. I don't fucking. Oh my god. That. What the fuck is wrong with you? No food or drinks on the ring. <laughs> bro, I'm fucking. I'm killing Angela, bro. That's that's it. I'm fucking killing her. <laughs> oh, poor L, dude. Ah. <laughs> You know what I'm doing if I'm like, I'm before any, okay. As soon as that entire thing fucking started and the spotlight turned on on L, and then like, as soon as Mike realized what's happening, I'm fucking racing over there on the rollerblades and I'm just shoulder checking the fuck out of Angela by accident. And I'm knocking her on her fucking ass and all of her friends. Fuck all of them, dude. Like this, I'll put it on the screen how I, how I envision it in my head. Okay, you are now calling from Durham, North- Alright, let's hear this. Ah, oh, it's just a payphone. Fuck. Oh. This is Ansel. Ah, uh, yes. Hello. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. That guy sounded way too familiar. Who the fuck- Sige, and I would like to make a reservation. Yes. That's Dragon. That's Dragon from Game of Thrones. Yes, I could tell just by his voice. That is Dragon from- yeah, that's him, 100%. That's fucking lit. For the girl, yes. Uh, yes, yes, 40,000. Good. You want me to go to Alaska? <gasps> oh. If Yuri money, Yuri gets me money, I give him your friend. Fuck. Speak to Hopper, we need to know that he's alive. Hey! Hopper is no one. <laughs> Hang up. <laughs> but you give me money, I make him unstuck. Fuck, dude. Yuri's fish and fly, two days. Do not call again. Fuck. Well, that was in the KGB. But it wasn't a friend either. Nope. So we're both wrong. So we're holding Hopper for ransom. I was jacking, bro. Yeah, I guess he's gonna get him unstuck and break his ass out of here. He's, bro, he's capable of so much shit, bro. Kill anyone you need him to. Just name him and he'll kill them. He'll get Hopper out of the KGB, bro. <laughs> this fool's invincible. Lieutenant Colonel, welcome to Indiana. Okay. He's a part of that freak devil cult hellfire. Oh, okay, okay. That's what I said. Chris, you would never touch this shit. Oh, well, you thought. Surrender blood for the devil. I just Satanists do that oh, shit. Oh, oh, cult. Yeah. It's just a D and D club. Yeah. They're gonna be like, why are you defending him, bro? I thought you, you know. 
They're gonna turn on Lucas right here. How exactly is it, you know, all of that, Sinclair? Cause I used to play, bro. But he can't. Yeah, she's like, she's like a total <sighs> Shit, I've read the wrong person plays this game. Confuse fantasy and reality and innocent people die. I mean, it's been happening all over the country. Okay, listen, 5-5 five, five, Tom Cruise. You got it wrong, okay? You're reaching here. You're just, a, you're very emotional right now because your girlfriend's, she got waxed, okay? Calm down. It's a sick game. And chances are he's still in the game. No. Why the cops go around pursuing some, some bullshit leads? Oh my God. All right, so they're all gonna get arrested for murder. <laughs> Lucas, you have to stop them. You have to just slow them down to get in their way. Cause he knows Eddie's innocent here. Lucas knows, no way Eddie did it, no way. They're, they're reaching super hard here. They didn't like Eddie to begin with. And now they're using, and now that this happened, they're like, oh yeah, we're gonna go kill him now. VHS, it's long, but it's because it's filled with action. Oh, she's, she's gonna be like, you wanna come watch it with me? So my boyfriend won't like totally puke when I bring. Oh, never mind. You, your boyfriend. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, you have. Oh, your boyfriend. Yeah, here I'm walking away. <laughs> fuck. I feel that, Steve. For Rick, and sometimes Eddie crashes there. Mm. That sounds. Be filled in on what we know. What's going on? You think Eddie's guilty, don't you? Well, yes. Somebody has to attend to the customers. Especially if they're babes, right? Yeah. Not fair. Okay, I attend to all the customers. Each Except that guy. Maybe we don't need a last name. Let's see if he's already in our system. Her, uh, mask, footloose, and grease. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Right. Might be, might have been Star-Lord, but... Cheech and Chong's nice dreams. That might be him. Smoke. Bingo. Lipton? Yep, that's him. Stoner movies. And I'm not interested in gossiping no more. Mm-hmm. Chuck Bailey. Fuck Chuck Bailey. And that guy doesn't know his ass from his elbow. Mm-hmm. I don't even know who that. I don't have a picture of him in my head. I don't know who that is, but she used to work with him. So, oh no, he's getting another vision. But he didn't do this. Mm-hmm. You ever hear the name Victor Creel? Victor Creel? Okay. Victor Creel. No, Fred. Do not go in the woods. Do not. Kids and wife. Damn. Took their eyes. Oh. Same exact. Thing. Damn, okay. Like that, what's his name? White mask and kill the babysitters. Michael Myers? Yeah. Yeah, it's me. Victor's like that. Damn. Bro, Fred. Fred's gonna die right now, bro. Fred's gonna die. Oh my god. Knowledge just jumped off my fucking bed and that look, he scared the fuck out of me. Oh! Whoa, I'm good. I'd see you guys. I'm out of here. Murderer. Murderer. Up the scars back. I can see it clearly now, but I mean, it was a Nancy and they're walking around. I couldn't, but it might just be like his guilt that's like triggering these for him. Oh, we're bus cutting Hopper. Bus pay mild. If you're foolish enough to escape, you will be hunted down and you will suffer greatly. Bro, is this the fucking gulag? What is this? Run. You die. Mm hmm. Bro, who is this? I want to be Joseph Stalin? What the fuck is going on? The answer is not on that tape. Bro, it's Jagged, I'm telling you. Can you translate that? Yeah. Don't know who you are. She, she wants to use the phone. Yeah, that's what I thought. She was just waiting and she's like, hurry up. Literally, Russo translates to trash or garbage. It's like pig here. Often directed at cops. Musa, I'm going to use that. Hopper stuck. In jail. And Enzo can get him. Yeah, Enzo's a guard there. That's, that's what I assumed. Enzo's a prison guard. Mm hmm. Sounds like Jim, doesn't it? Yep. I'm gonna get Enzo. Damn. Goddamn, 40k? Are getting Hopper back. Bro, you have 40k? Just like that? Or are you gonna take a loan out or what? Which is why you just like to be a douche to her all day? Ooh. I wasn't beating it. You were moping, you were barely talking, you basically sabotaged the whole well, day. Well, she was lying to you, Mike. Straight Bro, that's not him being a douche. He just didn't want to... Like, he knew what was going on, but he didn't want to fucking be, like, call her out on it. I feel like Will's not confrontational. He'd rather just have peace, so he'd just rather not say anything. Well, you're mad that I didn't talk to you? Oh. That's just not true. You called maybe a couple times. It's been a year. Aww. Meanwhile, Elle has like a book of letters from me. Yeah. 
to be best friends. Then maybe you should have reached out more. I I don't know. But why? Mike, take it. Uh. Let's just let's just find her, okay? I guess it's like 50-50, but like still, dog. I don't know. I still reach out to my friends if like I haven't seen them in a minute. So, but then again, if I don't hear anything back from them, I probably won't keep reaching out to them. I'll just wait for them to get back to me, you know. I'll, just, I'll give them their space, but still, like, ah, it's such a tough situation. Oh my god, I fucking hate Angela so much and all her fucking stupid ass friends. Like, I literally hope they die now. Like, I literally hope they get waxed in the show. Yes, I'll do something. Yes. Angela! Fuck you. Uh-oh. I'm going for <laughs> I want you to say sorry to me. Oh. I want you to tell my boyfriend that it was just a joke. Oh. And that we are really friends. No. Or what? You're gonna hurt us with your mean stare. Uh. I have to cry to your daddy instead. Oh, wait. Can't do that either. Oh. Oh. I hope this bitch dies, bro. I hope she gets fucking absolutely waxed. <laughs> bro, she might be worse than Joffrey. Nah, I'm just kidding. But like, oh yes, go beat her. Go fucking hit her upside the head with that. Yes, yes, yes. Go kill her right now. Yes, yes. Angela. Oh yes, she actually did it. Yes. Fuck that bitch. Fuck that bitch. Okay. Bro, that's respect though. Hell yeah. But now there's like actual consequences to what you did. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, oh my god. Holy shit, hell. What did you do? I did what I had to do, bro. What did you do? Fuck. It's comparing it to the scene where she lashed out and killed everyone. See, look, okay, that's the shitty thing. It's like Angela technically, like, Angela is obviously being a bitch, but she didn't ever physically hurt Elle. She just hurt her feelings, you know? And, like, obviously, Elle is super frustrated, so she physically, she retaliated by physically hurting Angela, but now there's, like, real consequences to what Elle did and not really anything to what Angela did. So, that's, like, the shitty thing, you know? Like, the only way you could get back to Angela without getting in real trouble is doing what she did to you or her. But now Elle's gonna feel super shitty about what she did because it just reminds her of what she did when she was a lot younger and killed everyone. So... I mean, bro, I don't really blame Elle for taking the roller skate and hitting Angela. I hate Angela. I... Uh, I don't blame her for that. I... I'm not gonna say I would have done the same thing. I would have pussied out for sure, but I would have I would have wanted to. Jesus, Steve. Take that yeah. Don't worry. Steve will get him with his oar. Uh, I know. Yeah. About a hundred times personally. I don't find it funny in the. Oh shit. It was Eddie. He's in there. Eddie. It's me. Damn, Eddie's ready to kill. Eddie's ready to kill. No, gonna hurt you, right, Steve? I don't know. He hit me like a hundred times with that fucking oar. So. You know Robin from Band. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know. After that, I might start thinking, man, maybe he did fucking kill her if he was ready to just kill Steve like that. But he's so defensive right now. It's like after what he saw and everything. Like, fuck, dude. I want to know what happened. You won't believe me. Oh, we will, bro. We will. We already have an idea of what it is. We've been through this shit three times already. Oh, Nancy Fred's fucking dead. This fool's dead. Officer? What are you still doing? Yeah, this cop's like, why are you still here, bro? You got here at like two, 1 p.m. It's like fucking 10 now. Maybe see him leave with somebody? Or nope. I told you kids to go home. Jeez. Yeah, bro. You should have just listened to him. Oh. Lifted up into the air yeah mm -hmm. and her bones gosh mm. they have just started breaking i mean like that's not we haven't seen this yet yeah it's like they're listening to this like yeah we haven't seen this yet Pulling. Ah. 
We don't think you're crazy don't at don't all. Don't bullshit me, man. I know how this sounds. Bro, we're vets. You know how people say Hawkins is cursed? Well, they're not wrong. Sometimes it bleeds into ours. Sometimes? What do you mean sometimes, bro? It's more than just a few times. I mean, only three times. I guess it's a few, whatever. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, Fred's dead. Fred's literally a barb. He's dead. Oh, the Sinister's... Oh, fuck. <sighs> it would almost look like dust. Swirling dust. No. Pretty sure I saw that. Enjoy me. Mm. Damn. Okay, so it seems like he's recruiting people, kind of like how Billy was building an army. Or under a spell. Mm -hmm. A curse. Vecna's curse. Vecna's curse. Ah, uh, R.I.P. Fred. Who's Vecna? From D and D. All right, we're gonna use D and D to fight this fool. I already know it. That's how we're gonna figure out. That's how we're gonna figure out how to beat him. Is each tentacle for a body he's gone so far? Alright, well that was season four, episode two. Damn, well RIP Fred. Shit. Alright, we're gonna use DD to fucking beat this shit. Alright. I'm here for it. Alright, so that was season four, episode two of Stranger Things. Oh another banger of the season. Really enjoying the season a lot so far. <sighs> but L, she got her, she okay. I think Angela totally deserved what L did to her. I 100% justify, bro. They've been verbally and physically, well, more more like verbally abusing her, which is so fucking annoying, dude. Ah, not like physically like hurting her, but you know, like they threw the drink on her and shit, you know, and then L took the rope and fucking whacked her and just whacked her, which was really satisfying. But you know, I think um I think a Sotogari to a cross Ashigarami to an inside heel hook and then just crank that shit would have been a little bit better. I think that would have sufficed a little bit more. But yeah, that works. That works, I guess. That works. So I'll take it. I'll take it. Also, if you know what I just said right there, if you know you know. If you know you know that would be that would be fucking brutal right there. If she did <laughs> But okay. So I guess we're calling this new enemy Vecna now we're naming him after a Dungeons and Dragons enemy so okay a D&D villain okay okay Vecna fuck Vecna but it got Fred right there it got Fred it totally just waxed Fred I, it, okay it kind of seems like someone's gonna die every ep voice rack it's it seems like someone's gonna die every episode now it's kind of I mean like that's been pretty consistent through two episodes so far so you know kind of i feel like he's building an army because he said the same thing that chris he, he said to fred i want you to join me you know kind of seems like kind of seems like the same thing billy was doing here okay but i, I want to know like how did this fool come about like how was he created like what the fuck like what the fuck like was he a demodog that just never got killed and fully grown up or like what where is he from and like what who opened the gate why is it open now and I want to know all those things, okay? I want to know all that. It was probably the Russians doing their bullshit, but okay, we'll find out for sure later on. But okay, so we found out that Jagan's a prison guard. Jagan wants 40k for Hopper, and then we gotta go to fucking Alaska to go and get him. I mean, shit, I am fucking, we're doing it, we're doing it. Oh, also, nobody interrupted me during this watch, which was pretty fucking surprising. Wow. Hopefully, I can record this early. More consistently because most of the time i don't start recording till like after midnight because i can't like people just constantly come in my room and it's like ah you know and if they like need to talk to me real quick i gotta stop and then i gotta start a new clip and then i gotta resync it and it's, ah, it's just a pain it's, ju it's just a pain when it comes to editing so and then jason on his little fucking basketball team they're gonna try and track down eddie to go and kill him because you know they they just assumed that Eddie killed Chrissy now because he plays D and D. Oh my God! And it kind of seemed like when Lucas was was trying to explain to them, like, no, we're like, like, what's going on? You know, with that, it they kind they just totally flipped on him right there. Like, bro, like, I fucking hate. Oh, I hate that entire squad. I hope Jason dies. I hope he dies next. I really fucking do. But anyways, 
That was Stranger Things Season 4, Episode 2. Comment down below what you thought about this episode down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.